It's been nine years since the world was blessed with Friday. 13-year-old Rebecca Black became a household name overnight on February 10th, 2011, when her music video hit the internet. It was panned by some and adored by others, becoming an undeniable sensation. And at its peak, the song hit number 58 on the Billboard Hot 100 chart. Rebecca is now 22, and she's learned a lot from being thrust into the spotlight as a teen. She faced lots of tough moments growing up, from battling depression and shame to the music producers shutting their doors on her. And in honor of the ninth anniversary of Friday, Rebecca opened up about the wisdom she's learned along the way. She wrote, Nine years ago today, a music video for a song called Friday was uploaded to the internet. Above all things, I just wish I could go back and talk to my 13-year-old self, who is terribly ashamed of herself and afraid of the world. To my 15-year-old self, who felt like she had nobody to talk to about the depression she faced. To my 17-year-old self, who would get to school only to get food thrown at her and her friends. To my 19-year-old self, who had almost every producer slash songwriter tell me they'd never work with me. Hell, to myself a few days ago, who felt disgusting when she looked in the mirror. Rebecca continued, I'm trying to remind myself more and more that every day is a new opportunity to shift your reality and lift your spirit. You are not defined by any one choice or thing. Time heals and nothing is finite. It's a process that's never too late to begin. And so, here we go. This might be a weird thing to post, but the honesty feels good, if nothing else. Alongside her words, Rebecca shared a before and after photo of herself then and now, showing how much she's grown up and how far she's come. The pop singer has accomplished a lot since 2011. She competed on the second season of The Four, Battle for Stardom, and she's been making lots of new music. After Rebecca posted her message and photos, fans flooded her comment section with their love and support. Those fans have been there since the beginning, and Rebecca told Access Hollywood about her love for her supporters at RuPaul's DragCon in Los Angeles last year. I, a lot of the time, a long time ago, got only really a lot of negativity, and there were people that like stuck through and said like, hey, I support you, I believe in you, or whatever it was, and um, to see those people still be there and also to see it grow and like be in places like this where not only I feel so lucky to just even be a part of it, I'd come to this as a fan, but to have people be so supportive here, it's, it's amazing. Rebecca also talked to Access about how the public perception of Friday is different now than it was back in 2011. It's been so long and the internet has changed so much that I feel like the stance and like the viewpoint on that song has changed a lot, which is great because the reality with that song is like it was me being the 13 year old girl, like just trying to figure it out and, and do something fun. fun. It was fun. And at 13, yeah, I liked Fridays. It was the last day of school every week. Yeah. So that was my reality. And um, and so it's been really cool to see people be like, hey, we sing this at work every Friday. Will you please like sing a little bit of us for us this Friday? Or will you sing it for my friend? She loves the you or your birthday, or, mm -hmm. no, her birthday, for her birthday, whatever it is, like it, it's so kind, it's so cool.